How fast is it moving with constant velocity from here to here? 0.4 meter per second. 0.3. 0.3. What about you? I'm just going to say 0.4. 0.4 meter per second. Okay. Hey there, my name is Shibona Wajik Berry. I'm a graduate student here at Stony Brook. Stony Brook University student can help me with a physics experiment. Distance versus time. Velocity. Not velocity. What is the slope of distance versus time? Anybody? Oh. Velocity. Not velocity. Speed, right. Oh. Because distance is a scalar quantity. The stopwatch and they're going to measure the time when the buggy passes 0.2 meter, 0.4 meter, mm -hmm. 0.6 meters, 0.8 meters, and 1 meter. All right, so let's see how it goes. All right. So this is a graph of all the data points we've accumulated. This is 0.2 comma 0.71. This is 0.4 comma 1.21. This is 0.6 comma 1.81. This is 0.8 comma 2.17 and this is 1 comma 2.56 so we have all these points and now we're going to draw the best fit line what is a best fit line well unlike linear regression which is basically the line that's closest to fitting all of these points That right there should be a suitable best fit line. One is right on. Yeah, one is right on. Oh, there's actually no trace of it, but it should have been around here. Three below, two above. So I think that's a suitable best fit line. I think we might have to work with non-integers this time around. One. And now we have to deal with x2, y2, which I'm going to choose as something along here. Or maybe a little bit shifted so I can actually fit the input on there. Like that's about 1.1. So we're going to work with 2.5 comma 1.1. Right out speed. So it's going to be the final distance minus the initial distance over the final time minus the initial time. So let's rewrite that when plugging everything in. D final, that's going to be 1.1. The initial, that's going to be 0 0.6. T final is going to be 2.5 and T initial is going to be 1.5. So that gives us 0.5 over 1, which is just 0.5. So my approximation of the slope is 0.5x, well, m equals 0.5, even though the real slope is 0.424, dot, dot, dot. So I was pretty close. I was only off by a little bit, about 0.08, which is not a lot. So yeah, that's it.